Hello and welcome everybody. Today we're talking about security on poker chips and we're gonna use a black light. This is all something I got off of Amazon. It was like a two pack or something, I don't know. Look, check my Amazon shop in the links in the description below if you're interested in black lights. In my day, back when I was younger, yes, decades ago, they used to sell like these fluorescent black lights that were I think more black light than these black lights because this is like purple. Can you see that? It's like purple. No, so there's actually light coming out of here. It's not just this like black light. So you call it ultraviolet light, but it's not really ultraviolet because you can see it. And we use it to see security on poker chips, okay? So in my opinion, everybody out there, you don't have to get this one, you don't have to use my Amazon shop, but everybody should have access to a little, what are we gonna call it? A violet flashlight that shows you uh, identifying features on poker chips, all right? So here's a Luxor. And what identifies this is a 1995, not a 93. Is, are these, is the security ink, okay? Can you see this? To me, it looks purple, like the glowy blue, but on my camera viewfinder, it looks like it's showing up as white. But either way, clearly security features, right? That distinguish this from the originals. Okay, good, it's good to identify your chips. Other things, it's like people like to relabel chips, you know, and you, it's easy to tell. You shine it on here, you can see the top hat and cane in the middle of the inlay. Can you see that? It's not just the Horseshoe Cincinnati, pick one. Uh, Jack here, okay? Same thing, can you see the, that's kind of hard to see here. Let's see if we can find a different one. Maybe this one will not glow so much. Yeah, can you see the little top hat and cane? The green, it shows up here on my viewfinder is green. It looks green in person too. Little top hat and cane right there in the middle of the inlay. All right, so it hasn't been relabeled or anything. Good, easy to do. Uh, it's also fun. <laughs> just I'm just gonna have some fun with this while we're on the subject. So it's something that will help you identify your chips, all right? So recommended if you're into collecting. Most collectors already have a little flashlight. They're like 10 bucks, whatever. Easy to get a hold of. The other fun thing is like when you look at chips sometimes, it also like distinguishes the difference. So here's a whole bunch of blue chip, okay? So looking here, all right, here's that looks like. So this two looks a little bit lighter than this one. All right, so were they made in different runs? The answer is yes, they were. And you can tell pretty easily by looking at them. You can see there are some that are lighter and some that are darker. This is also a sign that one uses a UV reactive material. Can you see that? How some are super light and you can see that easily with the UV light. Pretty interesting. You can see here, this is blue chip, so there's no top hat and cane there. Very interesting. Other thing, just might as well just scroll through some. Here's some Bud Jones, Wyndham, Old San Juan. Very glowy, it's like sneakers, money tree. Look how bright those are, oh my goodness, like the reflectors on that. Here are some Paulson. These are some Paulson Classic and Paulson Top Hat and Cane. Same thing, you get these lovely glowy things. Very, very cool. You can see all the little, pink dots where that reactive material gets spread around. Pretty cool, I think, I don't know. See, my lights are on bright. One of my problems with these lights, man, I have a lot more to say. I thought this would just be like, you know, 30 seconds, and I don't have anything to say, but I actually have a lot to say. I don't like using these in the dark, all right? So when you're looking for like stains and stuff, like with pet, for any, if anybody's had a pet, you know, you, usually we have bigger ones, but you walk around and it's just like, it's so bright when you find something and you're like, oh, my eyes, because your eyes are adjusted for the dark and then you get this really bright, glowy, blue, purple, whatever. So I like using it. See, my lights are on full right here and I like using this in light so it doesn't hurt my eyes. I'm not sure, it still might hurt my eyes, but whatever. So those are my thoughts. And again, this isn't a great brand. This isn't a great flashlight. It uses three AAA batteries, which is an odd thing. And who, who, you don't buy AAA batteries in groups of three. Either way, that's what I have for you today. If you don't, if you're interested in collecting chips, if you have some collectible chips, like let's talk about like obsolete casino chips, ceramic chips, you want to identify them, you want to see these security features. This one says pyramid, 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 pyramid on the other side. Pyramid, 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 pyramid. All right. So obviously 1995. Let me know your thoughts. Do you have a preference for your violet colored LED lights and what you know I have tons of chips I don't I don't want to I don't want to go through all of them to show off everything but you know here's Cleveland 
Same thing, you can see the top hat magically appear by the shoe, the horseshoe right there. Yeah, so interesting, interesting. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know any chips that you would recommend people look at in their, with their purplish light, whatever we are gonna call these, in the comments below. As usual, thanks to my patrons. Thanks for making all of this possible. I really appreciate my patrons. I'm gonna give credit to anybody who would like, who is a patron. And you can also support this channel by visiting my Amazon shop and get a black light. By visiting, yeah, so I am an Amazon associate. I make proceeds from qualifying purchases. That money goes back to my YouTube. Generally speaking, if I ever, I haven't made enough yet where it's not coming back to my YouTube channel. So you can help out by shopping. Really helpful. As usual, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe.